You want to see one of them? They're young biologists searching for answers. Are you doing all oh, there's a worm. And they're finding them, not in a textbook, but rather a stream. Oh, water in love. <laughs> Woo! These Hastings High School students have spent the past year in an environmental classroom. Joe Beatty is lead biologist. Instead of uh, learning about it by saying, uh, this is what people do, they are the people. They're in the actual out of doors learning it by doing it. What they're doing is looking for evidence of the health of the Vermilion River. To determine that, these novice scientists need to find what's in it and what's not. So we want to get a nice sampling of all the different habitats that are available. This room is doing pretty good if they have some of those in there. Yeah. Should we keep digging a little bit? In a forest or prairie, they might be sampling plants and animals. In a stream, they're looking for macroinvertebrates or bugs. This, this is a, a water scorpion. Oh, okay. See, look at the, when you look at the, he's got a really big beak. See it right oh, yeah. there? Yeah. Oh, I see it. In the lab, these students identify their tiny specimens. Okay, you got plates here, but they're not on the abdomen. They're, they're on the higher. thorax. If these students were analyzing the water for chemicals, they'd only have a sense of how good or bad it was at that moment in time. But by looking at the bugs, they can gauge the biological health of the stream over a period of time. It lets us get a trend analysis. Daniel Huff is the Dakota County environmental educator. So are the, is the quality going up because of efforts that we're doing, restoration efforts, conservation measures, or is the quality going down over time because of development or you know, improper management practices? Or the information these students gather is used by professionals with the DNR and counties to determine what steps may be needed to protect streams. Almost a half of the land area drains into the Vermilion. So the county has a real vested interest in what the quality of the river is and how the watershed is managed. Caddisfly, there you go. For these young biologists, the opportunity to do good work can be more important than a good grade. The uh, type of environment that's in Minnesota is different than, you know, other areas. And if you lose it, it's gone forever. Even bugs can sometimes teach you something.